Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we will go inside the SAP system and explore more about material types and material groups. Now, before I start, I want to say something very important. It is very evident that people are finding value from my videos. Now, if you are really finding value, please like, share and subscribe to my channel. Please check this data where it shows that, you know, 74% of my viewers are finding value from the videos, but they have not subscribed. So I appeal to all the viewers to like, share and subscribe to my channel. And please hit the bell icon so that you do not miss any notifications. Thank you. And let's start. Now, there are two concepts which are very important to understand. What is, one is material type. So it is a characteristic and it is used throughout SAP and it's a very important uh, part of SAP. So if I give you an example, like I can categorize materials under one type. For example, if I have a raw material, so raw material is a material type. If I have semi-finished goods, semi-finished is a material type. If I have finished items, finished items is a material type. So I can assign materials which have same settings into one type which is called material type and you can categorize the material type inside mm01 so so when we show you how to create a material master we will show you that at the time of material creation you can select which material type you are choosing to create that material another concept another characteristic is material group so you may have uh, several materials which you can group into. So for example, if there are speakers and audio devices, it can be grouped under sound systems. If you have desktops and televisions, it can be grouped under electronics. So electronics will be a material group and desktop and television are the materials. So a desktop will have a different material code Television will have a different material code and it is grouped under material group electronics. Similarly, speakers and audio devices are different types of materials which can be grouped into sound systems. So this is the concept of material group. So now let's check in the system how do we create and configure material types and material groups. So to configure material types, we have to remember a T code that is called OMS2. So if I go into the SAP Easy Access screen and type OMS2, then we get the screen which is called change material type. So here we have all the standard material types that are available in the SAP system. Okay. So if I scroll down, there are numerous material types and also we can create Z material types as well. So we can use the copy functionality. For example, if you want to copy, uh, for example, product catalogs into a Z type. So we click on this and click on this option copy and we have to type in a name. So it will start with Z and we can create a new material type. So if we want a uh, uh, the Z material type of service or spare parts or finished product, we can click on it and copy it and use it for our project purposes. So if I choose spare parts and I double click on this option, then I can have an overview of the material type. So here we see the material type code and we have the description here. This is the general data wherein we have the field reference and the authorization group. We also have this option external number assignment without checks. So if I check this option, I will be able to set my own naming for my material codes. Now here we have the item category group and the cross material status. So for example, if I select here, we have different options. So if it's a design or design plan, I can use here the, X, the, the, the cross plant material status. Now, this is important. These are the user departments which can use the material. So whatever selection I do, I will be able to have these views in MM01 screen. So you know that in MM01 screen, we have a lot of views. So the views will be based on what selection we have in this section. Okay. Now here for external purchase orders, I can, I can have, you know, if I want external purchase orders or not. I said say two yes external purchase orders are allowed so if I set two then 
we uh, this material can have external purchase, purchase orders and th this is the internal purchase order so if i have uh, if i go to here so no purchase or not so if, if i select this option no internal purchase order orders allowed then it would not allow the materials under this group to create any purchase orders now if i scroll down there are more control like what is the price i want to have standard or moving average price now quantity and value updating i if i want uh, value and quantity updating i have to check this option okay so these are some of the controls that are there so this part can be viewed from this option as well so if i double click here i can see all my plants wherein i have selected value and quantity updating so if i whatever plant is there so if i want to update quantity and value i have to check these options here so this is all about material types now we have to remember another t code for material groups now the t code for metal groups is omsf so it will be the t code so if i press i would be able to go inside the metal group now these are the metal groups as, as i told that you know a semi-finished can be one group and whatever materials are there it falls under the semi-finished group so hardware can be a group services can be a material group now if i choose new entries here i can create new metal groups from this option also if i want to copy if i want to copy an existing group i can select here and click on the copy option and then i will be able to create a new material group and set the description so so if you see that this this is an exhaustive list of of uh, materials material groups the computer hardware services contract type okay, if i scroll down I have spare part services and uh, different types of hardware so so this is all about material group and material types so thank you for watching let's connect in another video see you soon